Hey guys, I'm Alex. Thanks for clicking and welcome to this lesson on short answers with do and have. This is an expansion on a previous lesson on Engvid. Um, so if you want more information about short answers with do and have, you can check out the video linked to this video. Okay, a common mistake that students sometimes make when they are learning English is they don't know when to use have and when to use do when they have a short answer. So this is short answers as in yes or no questions. Okay, so for example, the first question I have on the board is, do you have a car? Okay, do you have a car? So we have two verbs here. We have the main verb, which is have, Okay, this is the main verb. And we have the auxiliary verb, which is do. Okay, first rule about short answers is when you give a short answer, pay attention to the first verb in a yes no question. Here, the first verb is do. Now, I know you see the main verb have. You think, do you have a car? You might think, yes, I have. Incorrect, okay? So what you have to do is pay attention to that first verb. So if you have a yes, no question, always listen to the first verb. It's do you, yes I do, no I don't. If it's have you, then it's a little different. We'll get that to that in a moment. Okay, do you have a car? The correct answer, yes I do, no I don't, or yes I have, no I haven't, should be clear now. It's yes I do, or no I don't. Not yes I have, or no I haven't. Now, what tense, what grammar tense is this question in? Present. Perfect, no. Past simple, no, no. Yes, exactly, you, um, you're correct. That is in present simple, okay? So, when you have a question in present simple or past simple, and remember, the past of do is did, okay? Um, so, did you have a nice time, for example, um, the rule is the same. Yes, I did, or no, I didn't. So, present simple questions, yes, no questions. Do you have, okay, or do you like? It doesn't matter what this verb is. Focus on the do verb. Here, I think the answer is obvious already, but let's go through it. Have you read the Harry Potter books? Now, this question, what tense is it? Correct, present perfect, okay? So, present perfect, as you might know, has the auxiliary verb have and the main verb, which is a past participle. So, what is the past participle here? It is read. Okay, so here you have a past participle, which we use with the present perfect. And here we have have, which is the auxiliary verb. Now, remember what I said in yes, no questions, you always focus on the auxiliary verb for the response. So here you have two possibilities, yes I do, no I don't, or yes I have, no I haven't. Um, if you have been paying attention, then you know the answer is Yes, I have, or no, I haven't. Okay, so this is the correct response. Have you read the Harry Potter books? Yes, I have, or no, I haven't. I have, they're recommended, I like them. Um, so guys, as a reminder, please, please remember, if you see, do you have, or did you have, don't think have, have, have. Oh, I use, yes, I have, no, I haven't. Um, Use the auxiliary verb, the first verb, okay? Um, so guys, if you want to test your understanding on this material and make sure that you never confuse yes I do 
or yes, I have again, check out the quiz on angvid.com. Good luck and take care.